About 9 million plastic bottles come here to the 7-Up Bottling Company in Reno each year. It is the only soft drink bottler in Nevada. It distributes a number of drinks and waters. There's a sophisticated system to fill them, cap them, label them, and distribute them to local stores. Once these bottles are emptied, their ultimate fate depends on the consumer. If you throw away your plastic bottles in the trash, they will end up in a landfill where they will last hundreds of years. A better way to dispose of your plastic bottles is to recycle them. Waste management, our, our tagline is thinking green, and recycling is a huge important part of you know, the, keeping the environment green. We have plenty of landfills and our goal is to actually reduce uh, and divert as much recyclable material from landfills as we can because landfill space, you want to maintain that so that you have to stop siting and stop you know, um, getting new landfills and building new landfills. So our goal is to divert as much from the waste stream as we possibly can through recycling. Drivers for waste management come to your neighborhood every other week to collect bottles, cans, glass and paper for recycling. Each month they drop off about 2,000 tons of waste at the Materials Recovery Facility, or MRF. The plastic bottles are separated and squished into bales to send to a plastic recycle center. We're able, to, like I said, to continue to move the plastic, which is really great. Um, there are some times where it's not as in demand as it, as it has been in the past, especially right now. Um, but we are, they could go anywhere from, we see a lot go to Oregon, we see a lot go into California. We see a lot of it go overseas, which is kind of where probably most of that plastic will end up. Justin says the amount of materials coming into the plant has gone down recently with the downturn in the economy because people are purchasing less. He is also having a harder time selling plastics for reuse. Fortunately, the number of products using recycled plastics grows every day. This is an example of a product that is made from PET plastics or plastic bottles. The list goes on and on. While companies like Patagonia have been at the forefront of doing things with plastic bottles like making fleece clothing, other companies are now getting on the bandwagon. Echo Reno owner Morgan Tier is filling her store with products made from plastic bottles and other recycled materials. It's PET plastic, it's recycled. And you can, Patagonia materials, um, you know, this material that they made backpacks out of or the linings of the purses or into a reusable grocery bag, um, even milk jugs into toys. It's becoming a thought process for people. Chair offers an alternative to using plastic bottles. She is also hoping to raise awareness through her business about the need to be more green. People are just becoming more aware. We always say use conscious, you know, you know make conscious decisions, like think about what you decide to do. Um, there's a lot of older companies like Dr. Bronner's or Patagonia that have been around and doing this for a long time. And now it's, it's almost a fad. It is a fad. But it's a fad that's going to have to, it's going to become, a, it is a necessity. Make a difference with just a little bit of recycling each day. 